this morning in the Roadshow Kitchen, one of our favorites is back Bob Burke from Patafia. He's got bacon going in the oven for oh. no apparent reason other than we just like to snack on bacon anytime Bob is here. And then we are going to get to the recipe at hand, which incorporates a lot of um, local berries. Strawberry season is, is gosh, like a week away, if not right now. They're popping up. We can incorporate them into this recipe. I wanted to get everybody ready for something that used to come. Uh, I would wait for Grandma. Eventually, one weekend uh, in June, she mm -hmm. would show up with her tomato basket, and in it would be fresh cream, fresh strawberries, and her biscuits, and it would be the first <gasps> strawberry shortcake of the season. Aww. We've lost all of that because we have berries 24-7, 365. Yes. Every month there's berries in the supermarket, but we used to have to wait for the berries. Mm -hmm. uh, but I want to say to people, it's worth waiting for the locally grown. Go pick yeah. your own. It's a great activity. Mm -hmm. And I thought we'd do a recipe today to get people primed up for the first of season berries. We're going to make some crepes. They're going to be dessert crepes, not entree crepes. But we're also going to make one that you can use for a brunch. I know there's a lot of people thinking, what am I going to do that's red, white, and blue mm -hmm. uh, this coming uh, holiday weekend? Because it's the Gatsby Day Days. Parade, which means we get to do our Just a Minute Man, Boston's Not the First Shot Smackdown. There you go. We're going to celebrate that, but anybody who's thinking of a Gatsby this. Day recipe that involves red, white, and blue, our blueberries, mm -hmm. our raspberries, our strawberries, yep. and then... Lots of choices of creams that you can use. This I is a creme yeah. fraiche okay. from France. They like that because a lot of people want to reduce sugar. Mm. They want something that goes nicely with the berries without adding a lot of sugar. Right. And okay. a creme, creme fraiche, fresh. a mascarpone, or a regatta cheese are great combinations with berries that yeah. help keep the sugar down. And I like some chocolate with berries as well, so I'm glad you have those too. All right. We are feeling patriotic in the kitchen and hungry. I hope that bacon is ready soon. Stick yeah. around. We'll be right back. Back in the Roadshow Kitchen on this Tuesday morning, batten down the hatches, ladies and gentlemen. I told you to grab hold of something because, look, he's already at it again. Mr. Bob Burke from Potiphar is here. Look, it's a B&B. &B. Brendan and Bob, how are here you? Here we are, buddy. So, so, you've been hard at work on the... Flip the crepe. Uh, the berry dessert crepes. Yes, so we're getting ready for Gatsby Day. We're going up against Boston. Just a minute, man. Boston's not the first shot. And people are wondering, what am I going to eat with the little buffet that they do on their lawn as right. the parade goes by? We're going to have red, white, and blue crepes. Delicious. Is going Make to them be up ahead of time. Creptacular. It is going to be crepelicious. <laughs> I love it. And you put them in the refrigerator. Just put them in a nice dish. They're already made. Okay. When the crowds come and the parade is going by and you're chanting, Boston's not the first <laughs> shot. A patriotic way to get you in the mood is a beautiful red, white, and blue blueberry, strawberry, raspberry, and a little cream that we're going to put in it, mix with the berries, and uh, roll it up in the crepe. And it's a really easy. This is a great summer brunch recipe. Love the idea. All summer long, great summer brunch recipe. Outstanding. Now but you first, we have to flip the crepe. Well, wow. <laughs> something tells me you're a master of this. Ah, I'm going to let's fail. Let's see how you do. I'm going to fail magnificently. <laughs> I tried during the break, and Bonnie, who's over here, I just heard this. <laughs> so <laughs> she was chuckling, cackling, making fun of my. Do you need snack bacon to fortify you before? No. Well, we... I need snack bacon every minute of my life. But first, let's focus on the task at hand. Go this ahead. one doesn't look Actually, like it needs to be flipped anymore. Oh, uh, yeah, I think it does. I Actually, think it just needs one last flip, you know, Brendan. I, I don't think I can do it. The hand is a little too hot oh, for my delicate hand. Hot for your delicate Ready? hands. <laughs> <laughs> Nicely done. You know what it is? I yeah. <laughs> Why don't we try this again? Yeah, I know. You've got <laughs> carpal tunnel from all the crepes you've been flipping. Go ahead. I have little to no muscle strength. Everyone knows this. It's all in the wrist, right? It's all in the... <laughs> Let's try <laughs> this. <laughs> Again. This is now officially the practice crepe. Oh, yeah, <laughs> bad right there. Did we get that? You yeah. know the rule. If you um, <laughs> drop it, you eat it. So what we're going to do is each crepe has a pretty <laughs> side and an ugly side. So what we want to do is we want to put the pretty side down so that the ugly side is getting rolled so that when we're done, the pretty side is showing. Okay. Okay? So what I'd like you to do, uh, <laughs> let's go, mix together. Go See, home. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Resign. Uh, so no, no, no. You what gotta. You, you, you have work to do. Oh, in the come kitchen. on! Isn't that how this works? All right. What do you want? Okay. 
So put some raspberries and put some blueberries in with the strawberries, in here. which I already sliced up. All right. Yeah. So add those. I have washed my hands. I want everyone to know. You've washed your hands of this segment is what you've washed <laughs> Oh, I your wish hands I up. could. And I'm going to add. How many? All of them or what? Well, half of them. I'm okay. going to add a little regatta cheese. All right. Some more okay. strawberries. And that's going to kind of hold them together. Uh, no, let's do the blueberries All now because right. we said the theme was red, white, and blue, and we want to do that. That's right. And yeah. then I also want to remind people that it's summertime. And it's always a good idea when it gets humid to put your bowl, your whisk, and your cream in the freezer for a few minutes before you make your whipped cream, and then stir that together, please. It's, but that's enough right there, the yes. amount for people yeah. who want to try this at home and do yeah. it the right way, unlike stir me. stir that together. Do I vigorously and here's stir? Here's what I like. I always have a backup plan, you know, just in case the whipped cream doesn't come out. Mm -hmm. I always like to have a little backup plan, and that's what we're going to have ready, just in case. The day is too humid and the cream doesn't wet. Okay? I wish we had a backup. That's beautiful. Wish now, we had a backup a plan for when you were a guest on the show. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, but Bozo's dead. So there sorry to break the news, Brendan. Bozo died. Okay, what's so next? So put a spoonful of that right here in the center of the crepe, and we're just going to roll the crepe around it. Is that enough? It's beautiful. Beautiful. You hear yeah. that, folks? Now, beautiful. Roll the crepe around it. Hashtag roll the okay. crepe. Okay. There we go. Uh. Yeah. Roll it right around it. Mm. And then <laughs> a little tighter. A little tighter, yeah. It's not a taco. It's a crepe. So okay, now what? Now put it on the plate next to the bacon crepe. There we go. And we're going to wait for the guests to arrive. All right. If we wanted to make this into a dessert crepe, what we would do is take a little of this chocolate we've got and put a little chocolate sauce over it with a little bit of the whipped cream I'm making. And in the meantime, my friend, I think you should. Thank you, buddy. You deserve. I and my suggestion is dip it in the cho in the chocolate. The guest has arrived. Oh, she's oh, here. <laughs> so nice of you to come to our Gatsby Day Parade celebration. I'm <laughs> so here we are. Let's um, give her a fork because you don't want to eat these with Do your I fingers. We have a guest. And you know, here I'm going to turn it into okay. the dessert <laughs> crepe. We've right there. Up my friend did there it is. We've now had it's a dessert crepe. We've had enough and of each other's <laughs> crepe by now. So there let's wrap go. this up. Thank you, Michaela. Enjoy. Thank you, Michaela. For more information. Thank you. Rojo.com, lost total control. <laughs>